Murphy and Associates, please hold. Thank you for holding. I'll trip. Hmm. What's up, Doc? Bugs, why are you here? I don't know. Maybe because I work here? But you're not an accountant. Nope. But evidently I have great people skills. So what are you working on? The, the Papadopoulos returns. It's the most uh, complex, tedious tax return, and I get a uh, stuck with it every year. Well, what are you waiting for? Those taxes aren't going to retain themselves. Retain those taxes. Retain those taxes. Retain them. Retain them. Retain those taxes. Report that income. Find those deductions. Itemize those expenses. There were three seconds left, and everyone knew I was taking the last shot. Hi, I'm a, 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 a porky pig. Yeah, that's great. I'm Daffy Duck, the guy who didn't ask. Now beat it. Now where was I? Oh, right. So I get the ball, the clock starts ticking. Three, two, nothing but net. <laughs> Daffy Duck gets all the pretty girls. Is this seat taken? No, it's right there. You're looking right at it. Greetings. I'm Marvin, the foreign exchange student. Oh, where are you from? Mars. Well, ladies, I better get to class. Those straight A's aren't going to make themselves. <laughs> Hi, Daffy. Well, aren't you sweet? In fact, the only thing sweeter than you is that cake over there. Hey, cake for the lady! You know what? Cake for everybody! It's on me! Are you nerds enjoying the cake? It's stupendous! Yum! Is it able to eat that really on you? No! It's on you! <laughs> Daffy Duck! Daffy Duck! Daffy Duck! Daffy Duck! Now, now, ladies, here's the it. Take it easy. <gasps> bun Bun, I'm back. Lola? Is it a soul? I'm back in your life. At least for one date, when you can't say no because it's for a good cause. <laughs> Littering! Uh, our next bachelor is. Daffy Duck. Let's keep this money train rolling, ladies. Daffy has no job, and no education, and a credit score of negative 13. Let's start the bidding at $50? Anyone? It's for the charity. Tax deductible. Gross. Well, we tried. Our internet next batch. Too big. Sold. Courtesy of yours truly. How thoughtful. Thanks, Daffy. I took a 20 out of your wallet. Daffy, you're the best! We couldn't ask for a more generous team, Captain. There's more where that came from. There's more where that came from, right? Oh. Ho, 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 guess what? It's time for me to assign everyone their weekly nicknames. Ooh, this is my favorite part. Porky, your nickname tonight? The Porkinator. Pete? Your nickname, the Petonator. Oh, I like it. Uh, the Daffy. Hold on, Marvin. Your nickname, the Marvinator. Nope. The uh uh uh. Okay, yeah, the Marvinator. Uh, Daffy. I said, hold on, the Porkinator. And finally, since I am the team captain, my nickname will be the Grand Pooba. Wait. Make that Hooba the Grand. Porky, I changed my mind. You're player four. Now, let's bowl. Uh, hello? Hey, Pork. Oh, hi, Bobby uh, Bugs. What are you doing? Oh, I uh, just uh, bleep, bleep, uh, picking up my dry cleaning. Would you like fries with that? <laughs> you believe that? Why would I want fries with my dry cleaning? <laughs> yes, jello fries. Could you give me a ride? I'm stuck at the DMV. Is that uh, sure? Uh, just one thing. You have your driver's license, right? 
Uh, of course I do. Wait, are you gonna want oh, to catch up with your prize? <gasps> Hello? Where are you? Oh, sorry. You believe they messed up my order. Uh, I mean, my dry cleaning. Uh, oh, there you are. What are you doing at the DMV? Driver's license. What did I do? I've never been pulled over for anything. I followed the rules of the road. Safety first. You can't talk on a cell phone while driving without a hands-free device. Since when? July 1st. Ah, I voted for that. Also, I'm gonna need you to step out of the vehicle. Wait, why? Your license is expired. Ah! Uh oh, I know that one. Oh, that's an easy one. <laughs> Who wouldn't know that one? And done. Yeah, Daffy? Oh, hey, Porky. What are you doing here? My that driver's license expired. So irresponsible. Hello again. I think you'll really enjoy grading this. You passed. You, you, you got a perfect score. That's because I'm passionate about the material. Now, give me my license. That was the written test. You still need to pass the driver's test. Driver's test? How am I going to cheat on a driver's test? I'm sorry, you failed. What? That's impossible. I read the rules of the road every night before I the bed. You get to take it one more time. Maybe this time, don't answer B for every question. Got any rubber bands? Thanks. Scissors? Thanks. Tape? Thanks. Pencils? Thanks. I only needed the erasers. Hey, Pork, you got a second? Bugs, I'm trying to work. <laughs> Hi, my name's Diane. I'm Mr. Bunny's new secretary. Oh, can I get you a cup of coffee? Stop it! You're hurting me! Ah! The bugs, you quit it. What? I'm just having fun. You're not supposed to be having fun. You're supposed to be working. Why can't I do both? Uh, huh? Porky, the average person spends a third of their life at work. Why would you want to waste a third of your life being miserable? Uh, are you saying I should uh, quit? No, I'm saying that you need to make work fun. I don't know, Bugs. Well, I think it's a great idea! <laughs> where are we going, Daffy? I'm no longer Daffy. I'm Steve St. James, off-duty cop. And we're going wherever Justice is sleeping and needs to be woken up by me. Steve St. James, off-duty cop. So, I uh, just keep going straight? Pull over. No, park illegally. More illegally. Like you don't have time to play by the rules. Huh. <clears throat> Aren't you forgetting something? Oh, it, it, sorry. Where's Daffy? He's helping our neighbor's kid. Try it. We already got our pizza. No, try this one. Well, I like it. This one's frozen. It's pretty impressive. Pretty impressive? It's very impressive. Let me tell you something, Pinky. Uh, it's Porky. i like to see you make a restaurant quality frozen pizza. You couldn't. You know why? because it's next to impossible. But I did it, and now I'm going to sell Speedy Gonzalez's frozen pizzas in grocery stores all across the country! What are they doing? I'm filming the commercial later today. Hey, you should be in it. Nah. Come on, 
You can play the customer. Uh, I, I don't... I could play the, the customer. Pinky, please. I'm talking to Senor Bugs. What do you say? Will you be in my frozen pizza commercial? Yeah, I'd love to do it. Yeah, just let Porky do it. Can I at least use your slogan? What slogan? I like it. When did I say that? When you tried the pizza. It's the perfect slogan. Not too much, not too little. I don't love it. I like it. It's pizza, man. It's not a new car. Whatever. Oh, y yippee! <laughs> Relax, Pinky, okay? It's a commercial, not a movie. But go see the makeup girl. You're, you're just so pink. I guess that's where he gets his name. You got any paper clips? I, I used all mine. Thanks. Is that a chandelier made of paper clips? Uh, you were right, Bugs. It work can be fun. Well, I'd say that was a solid day's work. Wherever Justice tried to sleep, we were there to wake it up. Good work, chauffeur. Uh, are you sure the chauffeur did he, that doesn't have a name? Nope, just chauffeur. It will be, uh, the, the, why is your house covered in uh, the Christmas decorations? Isn't it always like that? Oh, hi. Hey, I hope you don't mind. I did a few things around the house. I painted the garage, I resurfaced the swimming pool, oh, and I moved everything that was in your room into the kitchen. But if you don't like it, I can move it back no problem. I just have three hours left on the treadmill. But after that, I definitely can move your stuff back into your bedroom. Unless you want me to move it into the garage. I just painted it. Uh, are you okay? Never better. Never, ever, ever better. Are you guys itchy? Huh, I like it. Closer to the fridge. Is it, so you're saying the chauffeur was in every episode and they and, and, and never gave him a name? I'll prove it to you. St. James, have your chauffeur bring the car around. He's a human being, Chief. He has a name. Brandon Steele. Use it. I do. Every time I address him. Oh, Brandon. Thank goodness you're here. <laughs> that was a stupid episode. Have you guys seen any sparkles that still have sparkle in them? I'm all out of sparkle and I need some sparkle. You know what I mean? What is wrong with you? Nothing. There's nothing wrong with me. I gotta get more sparkle. <laughs> hey, what are you doing in here? <gasps> I know what you're up to. Yeah, then you leave me no choice. I don't deserve to suffer. I mean, I probably do, but I don't want to. <laughs> Happy birthday. Say what? I, I, I know it's early, but it, you said you knew my secret, so I, I hope you like it. A collage made out of assorted yeah. photos of me? What on earth would possess you to make something this creepy? Uh, you believe because that's what you is specifically told me you wanted for your birthday? You sent me the photos. So you don't want to murder me? Why would I want to murder you? <gasps> Only a murderer would ask that question. What did you do to Speedy? 
Look who's got a wallet and keys now, chubby! Pinky was planning to throw this on your actual birthday, but he called and said we'd have to do it tonight because you were getting suspicious. You're lucky to have such a nice friend. Nice huh? friend? Or the Suburban Strangler? <gasps> oh! The strangler? Que que? I'm only not the Suburban Strangler. He trapped me in his home. He locked the door so I couldn't escape. You what? The door wasn't locked. Well, then, how come I couldn't just open it like this? No, just pull it, man. It's not that heavy. Kids use it all the time. Little kids. It doesn't matter. What does matter is that you cut the phone line so I couldn't call for help. Uh, are you talking about the phone in the guest room? It's an antique. It's, it's, it's just for decoration. Then how do you explain the blood on your hands? Either this is paint for the banner I made for your party. You may have all these people fooled, but I saw you murder a woman. It will be a what? With a chainsaw! Either the, that was an ice sculpture of you. <laughs> What's going on? Daffy's surprise party. I thought that was supposed to be next week. Ugh. We interrupt this program with a special alert. The Suburban Strangler has been captured. You gotta admit there's a strong resemblance. Am I right? There were three seconds left, and everyone knew I was taking the, the, the last shot. Hi, I'm Daffy Duck. Uh, yeah, that's great. I'm the guy who didn't ask. Now, be, uh, beat it. Is this seat taken? A, a cake for everybody. It's on me. <laughs> hey, nerd, are you enjoying the cake? It's delicious. Is it really on you? No, it's on you. So this means I wasn't the big man on campus. I was the big dork on campus. Wow. I really am a liar. And the greatest lie I ever told was to myself. Wait! Don't you see? This is good news. You thought you'd gone from here to here. But it turns out you never went anywhere. What's good about that? It means you haven't peaked yet. <gasps> You're right! You hear that, you losers? I didn't peak in high school! But you did! And you did! And you certainly did! Daffy, I've apologized to you about a thousand times. 
Do you want restaurant quality pizza in the comfort of your own home? Hello. I'm Speedy Gonzalez of Speedy Gonzalez's Pizza Riva, telling you that you can now enjoy my pizza in a frozen variety. But don't take my word for it. He's a real life customer. Ahem. <clears throat> what do you think, sir? I, I like it. God! Pinky, you're overselling it. I told you you could be in the commercial, but you, you gotta pull back. You gotta play real. Let's take it again. What did you think, sir? I, I like it. Nope, it's not working. Senor Bugs, let me hear you say it again. I like it. That's it. Perfect. Sorry, Pinky. There's just something about him, a eh? likability factor. I mean, this guy's okay, but I wanna party with this guy. Let's take it again. Hey, Pinky, I'm sorry. Scooch to your left a little bit. Little more. 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 How's this? Perfecto. Okay, come to the conference room. And bring the paper airplane. I give you... In me, me, Murphy and Associates International if we get a paper airport. And you are cleared for landing. Porky, how long did this take you? <laughs> Hours. <laughs> it's all I've been doing since lunch. <laughs> Pretty fun. <laughs> I know I said to make work fun, but you still gotta do your work. What about the Papadopoulos returns? They probably did the Papadopoulos returns. Wow. Paper baggage handlers. Mr. Murphy. What is this? It's a paper airport. Have you seen Porky? I need the Papadopoulos returns. This just in. All flights have been grounded. Due to snow! Jingle bells. You're fired. Oh, am I fired too? It's 11.30. Uh, yet you said the training begins at 7 a.m. The training began at 7 a.m. The first exercise, patience. You two, great job. Porky, you've got some catching up to do. Plus, the bowling alley doesn't open till noon. See you guys in a half hour. Ah! The bowling ball. The dictionary defines it as a ball used for bowling. And that is why the dictionary is stupid. Because to truly understand the bowling ball, you need to become the bowling ball. Are you sure about this? Bowling balls don't talk. <laughs> Strike! Ooh, nice! You can question my methods, but you can't question my results. Isn't that right, Porky? Porky, if you can hear me, I've never asked anything of you in my life. I, I can hear you. But in order to compete, we need to have four people on the team. I, I said I can hear you. I heard you all the way down the hall. So I want to ask you this one tiny favor. Get out of that bed. Remove your IV. Take the casts off your arms and legs, and bow. That's all I ask. Why don't you just ask Bugs to wait today to take my place? Bugs is the best bowler here. Right on. Yeah, what a great idea. I'm jealous of Bugs, but I hate Terry. Jealousy or hatred? It's like having to choose one child over the other. Hatred, surprisingly easy choice. Bugs, you want a bow? 
Sure. Uh, yay! yay! Then let's win one for Pooh! Yeah. Let's do it! You're not gonna need your wallet. You're in the hospital. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that, that's right. Yeah, these are all right. I have to pass. Yeah, yeah, Lola. Oh, hi, Porky. What are you doing here? <sighs> and my driver's license expired. Mm-mm. You and Daffy. So irresponsible. Hi. Sorry that took so long. I'm a little nervous. I'm not a really good test taker. I'm more of a test giver. Or a test watcher. Or a taste tester. You passed. Perfect score. Oh my gosh, you did? I'm a really good test taker. You failed again. What? What's happening? Let me take another one. I'm sorry, sir. I, you only get two chances. Did I at least come close? Here. Who are you? Steve St. James, off-duty cop. Arrest this one, too. What did I do? You've been impersonating a cop and handcuffing people all over town. What about him? He's been impersonating a chauffeur. That's not illegal. It's pathetic, but it's not illegal. Get this guy out of my face. I'm putting you down as a witness, so I'm gonna need your name, too. Brandon Steele. I'm just gonna put chauffeur. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> That's the best date I've ever had with a wizard. There's something I should tell you. I'm not really a wizard. <laughs> Finally. I was worried you weren't going to show up. What are you talking about? I thought we were having a dinner tonight. Oh, I think I might have eaten your dinner, Porky. How do you know my name? I don't. That was more of an observation. Are those for me? <laughs> <laughs> I gotta get a girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs>